Hey everybody, welcome to another video. And today, we're going to be modding some more uh, posters. Uh, last couple of videos and posts I made, uh, I did so on this um, modification that I did where I put the uh, paddle uh, uh, inside paddle. I, I forget. I don't even know what you call this. It's a. I know it's a paddle uh, clip. Okay, I call it a paddle clip. I attached it to the. Uh, Kydex holster dang old nerd made me for the Glock 26 and I attached it to this so I could use it for qualifications at the range and that was a temporary thing because I do not intend to actually use this holster for work or off-duty uh, purposes this was just so I can have a holster to put my Glock 26 in during my qualifications which worked fine, uh, it worked great, but I want to get something that's a little, maybe a little slimmer profile, because, and also I am going to take the old light off of the Glock 26. I just find it very uh, unreliable, not unreliable, but I wanna say not very accurate. Um, I zeroed it in last time I was at the range. I don't know what happened. Um, I don't know if it was because I took the Olight off and put it back on or whatever. Uh, but uh, it lost zero and it was not very accurate. So I'm not going to be using that combination anymore. So I won't need this holster. Um, I recently did purchase this holster for the 365X. Just for the qualification purposes, I think I may be returning this uh, only because I'm not a big fan of uh, belt looped holsters because it, um, if you're wearing certain belts, uh, it, it uh, like leather belts, it stretches the leather. Also, in my opinion, it just doesn't uh, fit flush. I did order I did order the uh, next belt. It should be on its way tomorrow. It should be here tomorrow. Uh, I'll do an unboxing video when that arrives. I decided to take dang old nerd's advice and just... It was a choice between next belt or core essentials. And uh, dang old nerd was right. Um, most of the YouTube reviewers did go with the core essential belt. But I decided, well, you know... I think I'll go with my friend's advice because he felt that the next belt was a little bit more comfortable. And I'd rather go with comfort than anything else. Uh, I have my EDC stuff out because lately it has been a godsend. I mean, this tool right here, I've been using this and my Swiss Army Knife uh, Swiss Champ, Victorian Swiss Champ. On all of my um, holster modifying needs. So it was just, I mean, and also when I was at the range, I was using this here to t put the uh, accessories on and take them off and stuff like that and make adjustments and all that. So I'm, I was really glad that I had all of my EDC stuff with me. All right, so let's move on. So today what I'm about to do what I'm about to do oh also I want to mention give praise to Dang Old Nerd's um, magazine holder that he made me. Uh, not only did it work for the sick P365 magazine, but it also worked for the Glock 26 mag. So I didn't have to switch out magazine holders. I just used this the whole time. This never came off my belt. Um, for both guns, both qualifications. So, shout out to Dingo Nerd for. I don't know. I don't think he really intended this to really fit a Glock 26. He he made this for my P365X uh, magazine. Here it is. Okay, that's that's what he made it for. But it also. It was, it's a tighter fit, but it also fits the Glock 26. 
magazine. All right, shout out for that. All right, let's move on. First of all, let's uh, make my gun safe. Boom. All right. I'm going to put my magazine and ammo way over there, away from the working area. The gun is safe. So, and I will put it on safe. All right. Uh, so, I'm going to retire this. I'm take that. Take these things off here. I'm going to retire that for now. Put that to the side. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to take this Warrior Land uh, holster. This is the inside the holster. Um, ho inside the holster. Inside the waistband holster. I'm sorry. I can't speak. Um, it has the Warrior Land weapons light uh, space for the space in the holster. Uh, so... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the Warrior Land weapon slide back on the Sig 365X so it'll fit in there, and then I'm gonna turn this inside host inside the waistband holster into an outside the waistband holster using the paddle belt clip like this, so that way I can wear this whole system for work. All right. Um, I'm gonna try to see if I could keep this leather piece on here. Uh, I don't think it'll be necessary with it being the outside like this. Uh, I hate to take this off because it, it when I do use this as an inside waist inside the waistband holster holster, this leather piece does keep uh, keep the gun from pinching my skin. And it is much more comfortable with this on there, so I might, I might, uh, I might just keep that on there. We'll see. All right, so I'm gonna speed up this process and uh, slow it down when I'm done. See ya. All right, so the uh, holster is on there. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you can see it through the mirror, but here it is. Drawing it is no problem. Reholstering is no problem. Yep. Not bad. Yep. Un unfortunately, it just has no safety retention. So that's why it's gonna have to be carried somewhat concealed under a jacket or some sort. Let's see how it looks under a shirt. This is a tight shirt, by the way, so. I, feel, I don't know, if it was a looser shirt, I think uh, I can get away with it, to be honest with you. I mean, uh, I think it's, uh, let me see. Yeah, if it was a looser shirt, I could probably get away with, nah, not really. It's a lot of print, a lot of bulge right there. But, uh,
It's comfortable. I tell you what. There is nothing more comfortable than wearing a um, paddle, belt paddle holster inside the waist. I mean, paddle. I guess they call it belt paddle. I don't know. But it's, it, it's so much better than a belt clip because a belt clip is just... I hate anything that's clipped to the belt itself. And then you have to tension it with the belt. And um, it just feels tight and uncomfortable. And it stretches the leather belts out. I don't like it. But um, the paddle that goes on the inside to hold the holster in. I love it. It's just so comfortable. It's the most comfortable outside holster you can wear. Okay. Um, and it doesn't put any um, work or pressure or uh, stress on the belt itself. So you can wear other stuff on the belt without uh, putting a lot of torture on the belt itself. So I like it. I love these paddle um, holsters. And uh, they're so comfortable. All right, so this is, I guess, uh, what I'll be wearing on duty. Okay. Um, I'll find. I'll have to find some kind of way to, I guess, have some sort of uh, security retention, sub sub kind of system. Worst case scenario, I could always use it for just qualifications, fast draw, you know, qualifications. All right. Looks good. Thanks for watching.